So I've been asked how um, we store all the kids' toys, so I thought I'd do a quick video on um, where they're sort of stored. They're all over the place because we don't have a toy room in this house. Hopefully, we're hoping to move later this year into a bigger house with a toy room. But um, this is underneath Lachlan's bed, so if you've seen the video of um, the tiny room one of the three boys, so I've got, these usually have books in them, but the kids have taken them out. And um, yeah, I'll show you them in a minute, where they've put them in the other spot they are allowed to. So we have his little pirate ship, that's Harry's pirate ship. This is just a little barbecue-y thing. We've had this since Andrew. I don't even know where the, used to have like little sauces and things that went with it. Um, and then we just put toys on the shelves. This is so not neat at the moment. They're usually put up neatly. Um, three of these boxes are Duplo. So they're in there. Um, so they have to go back neatly in there. But I do find them. I just put some of them in there that were on the shelves. Um, that's a little right on that sits under there as well. Just out of the way. This is parts to dress up, so like the face masks, or ones that won't hang, that's a turtle, ninja turtle shell thing that goes on the back. So all of those sort of things are in there. It's pirate pants. These are actually ones that should be hung. But they're in there. These are boy ones. The girls have their own in their room. Then, oh, at the end of Lachlan's bed is I put a bunch of hooks um, and these have so they're just the main part of the suit or the jacket to suit well, that's supposed to be on the same hook as the fireman jacket but so we've got Iron Man we've got this which we got in America in Washington um, yeah, Captain America. I think we've got a few Captain Americas. Oh, and there goes. We've got a few police. This is actually a basketball thing that they used to go to. Um, but it's no longer run by the government. So I never know what they do now. I think a private company has it. Anyway. Um, so I just put that there because I like to dress up as sports people as well. And then there's Mickey Mouse costume at the end. Um... And then we have this Trophus Tower from Ikea. I'm not sure if they sell the tour one anymore because there was issues in them tipping over and we've never had it even budge. This one is not attached to the wall either, if anyone asks. Um, you'll see later on we've attached other things to the wall. Um, this is actually stuffed animals in there and things up the top um the girls have the cabbage patch i know this is the boys room it used to be the girls room um so zoe's is at the front and bella's is at the back and then that is one of those beanie baby things i think they're all called beanie babies caitlin collected them for a while um and then this is all the my ponies is just for my ponies so there's heaps of them in there that's like a cheap company so my ponies are in there and all their accessories this is like matchbox cars or I don't know airplanes then there's a few mats in here monster truck ones ones that are a little like this size not gigantic so they go in there, that's a trailer to one. That is a duplo piece, it's not supposed to be there. Um, that's like a person that goes on one and just attached to a monster truck. And yeah, so there's a few mats in there for them to play with or put out. And then there is a carpet rug on this floor. But they tend to lay the those ones over it. You got a brush? You brush your hair. Ah. I dropped on my toy. Oh, and then there's that Hot Wheels thing there that doesn't fit. 
I'll brush your hair. There you go. And then in the next two tubs, we have wooden train tracks. There's wooden only. We have plastic tracks as well. These are really heavy, so. Um, you get it out. So, um, yeah, I have to get that one down usually. Um, so they're just wooden tracks. There's heaps of them. Then we have these at the end. If you remember when I did the um, um, the room tour, these are actually in their store and clothes, but they actually did my head in and I changed it. Um, so these have the big obnoxious toys at the top. So we've got Harry's guitar that you'll see him quite often walking around with. Um, this is just a tool bench. Then the Paw Patrol house, which is missing that telescopey thing. Um, and then these are just little things that they've left there. And then they just put things on the shelves. I'm not, they don't have to go back into the same spot. These are actually empty because I don't have anything. Um, so yeah, that is for more toys. So this is in between the girls and what we call the little boys room. What are you doing? Um, so this is, this is what we call the square because it's the most useless space ever. It's not big. Anyway, so this is where the little kids' books go. It's never neat because they're meant for the, the preschoolers and the toddlers. Um, so that's there. And the esky is my mum stuff. I have to go back to my mum's house. And then... What, Harry? All the kids have their desks, which we did buy so they could keep their special stuff and to study. But we purposely bought the ones with the hutch so they could put their special stuff. So these are Andrew's things that he's got. His hats, a motorbike he got when we went, and he's hiding glue from someone. When we went to Dreamworld, I think it was. Um, and then he's got those bear things, glasses, these things, no idea what they are. Then their Lego gets set up here. You can see it's neat. And my gardening glove. Yep. It's my house for you. Um, and then they have two drawers. I'm not going to open them. I'm too scared. Um, and then this is Lachlan's. I won't do all the desks. So he's got his Lego set up, and then his Hulk dude motorbike, and then he's got his puzzles, and no idea what this is. And this thing. And then they put their certificates and stuff on there, and they're two photos that shouldn't be there, but... Um, and then he's got his football. Um, he has a laptop on his because there's PowerPoint underneath. This is the kids, little kids share one, and primary school age kids share one. So this is in our hallway. This is Stephen's desk with Stephen. So these are where we put all, well not all the other books, there are some other places with bookcases. Um, all the books. This cupboard has spare, like... Ziploc bags and nothing, and I'm, that shelf is really dusty. Um, so they're my cookbooks, and they're um, like learning books. They're supposed to be anyway, because there's Eric's uni books, and same up there. And there's the kids swimming certificates. Then these are older kids' books, and you can see they put them back the way they should be. And these are more information books in this shelf is their photo albums I don't know how cupboards inside a cabinet get dusty but anyway and then more younger kids information books these ones these are story books these ones I have to read with us because I don't want them wrecked and then they're readers as in the ones they get at school and you can see that they've been put back 
um, in this cupboard, which is going to be hard because I've got Zoe's capsule in front of it, is board games. Well, these are puzzles at the moment. We took the board games out because they weren't, they couldn't get the cupboards to close. So they're just all puzzles in there. Oh, Mousetrap and Hippo game that they just got. Um, this one's all DVDs, which is so not toy related. Um, and then it's all DVDs in the bottom too. And because we've done every other desk, um, this is Cooper's desk. And Stephen's desk. Cooper's desk was neat. So this is the old, what we call the older boys room. So they've got these shelves up the top. These are all bolted, if you can see. So the bookcase is bolted to the um, drawers and the drawers are bolted to the um, um, bunk bed behind it. This is really messy at the moment. So this is Tyler's Lego, because he doesn't have a desk, because he's little. Um, I don't even know what this stuff is. We've got the Paw Patrol stuff. This should be neat, but... And then that's uh, Little People's. These are the most annoying things to store. The kids love them, though. And then Cooper has his pyjamas up there. Not sure. And then their Octonaut. And then his Paw Patrol aeroplane thing that he got for Christmas is up there. Um... So yeah, and up the top there is all Andrew's Lego that he doesn't want the little kids to touch. And I just, that is supposed to be on the end of the other bed with the Paw Patrol land. Um, I don't think you're supposed to have this. Really? You know it too. So that's the older kids Lego tub. Well, that's one of them. I actually have taken most of the Lego and put it in the garage. Um, I do take some stuff into the garage and bring it back. So this is Andrew's. It's a clown my mum brought him when he turned one. Um, and then there's um, Transformer Dude that no one can transform. And then more Lego of Andrew's. And a very colourful clowny dude. And there's more books down there. And in the top, Andrew has a basketball hoop there. Andrew stores all his Lego in the top of this wardrobe. Which is hard to see because I'm short. So that's all up there. Andrew can get that down, he's taller. Underneath there, are you alright, Kitty? Underneath the bottom are tubs full of toys too. Um, more tireless toys. I think those plastic tracks are under there, aren't they, Andrew? Um, yeah, it is. You haven't made the bed. Yeah. See, they're all toys, obnoxious, annoying toys. Oh, and they're the Hot Wheels tracks. There is plastic train tracks that are supposed to be under there. Oh, oh there. Really? So here is the dining room um, shelving with the photos. Really? So they have a bunch of toys here. I really need to go through these ones. That red bucket is actually hats. Watch it, Bubba. So the first. Are you right? Attack by the butterfly. The first one is tools, which is in the way. Uh, the second one is just, it's literally, I just put whatever I can't find. So pretty much have that shelf to be in there, but it's cool. The one at the leg is potato head men. They can't get to it at the moment because we put this desk for Eric to study at. Um, so that's all there. Um, I don't use these ones very often. I should really go through it. And there's an Octonaut pod house just behind that leg too. Hi, Joe. So here's the lounge room. Harry's got his mouse tools that belong in that first box, but he's got them there. Really? So this is our 
you would have noticed there was a slide here in some of the other videos. I'm drawing sheets on it. It comes in useful. So this is a cubby house they got a few years ago for Christmas. Um, and that's Zoe's where she gym thing. So this gets swapped with a slide. It's currently in the garage. Um, so we just swap them around when we feel that they don't play with it anymore. Um, this is Bella's kitchen, which was clean when I um, started filming all the other rooms. Um, this this is, belongs in that back bedroom. Um, Minon's dude belongs in Tyler's room. So these are all just baby toys. So little toddler toys get put in here. So these sort of things. Um, and that one as well. It's little kids bits and bobs. These are toys they haven't even opened from Christmas. Same with that bottom one. This one is all the food Bella got. It's missing quite a few. They were pretty much on it anyway. Um, so it's not neat at the moment. I wasn't gonna. It's the middle of the day here, so I wasn't gonna make them. Pack it all up. Is that Mickey Mouse? So that is, I think that's all the toys. So they're pretty much everywhere. We're hoping that in the house that we've designed, these are all going into a room, a playroom. Um, so the house and the slide fit. Um, and we have allowed for another house in that room. Uh, we don't have a TV or anything. What are you two doing? Um, yeah, so that's pretty much all of it. It all needs organising properly, but that gives you an idea of how I fit them all in. Bye. Say bye. Bye. bye.